Hello, page hunters. This is Levant here, and we are in the saving light. Now, this is an itch.io demo game on, uh, obviously itch.io, but the funny thing is that this is actually a pre alpha. Uh, and it came out yesterday, so. Beyond that, I guess let's check this game out. What? In the darkness, the child woke up. A lone flame is the only light to explore the house that she knew, but could not recognize my house. What time is it? Oh, this is actually- oh, cool. That's actually an interesting art style. Nope. Who is it? What are you doing? I wish to play. Huh? Ah! What? Are zombies here? No, you can't come in. Go away! Grab the crowbar. Dad, where are you? I'm scared. I must. I must get out of here. What kind of person? If she was asleep, what kind of person dress wears a full dress in bed? Better find a way out. Uh. The game has no sprint. Oh. Still warm. You open the topmost drawer, the key, some matches, and a letter. Who has left this here? The shadows fear the light. I have no more use of those. Take them. Three matches and a room key. Outside is pitch black. I don't like this feeling. I can't go back to sleep. Considering I must find Daddy. Okay. Uh. On the bed is picture. Photo of Daddy before moving. What's going on? Uh. Or that. How do I change? Pause. Interact. E is the item switch. Okay. The keys. Good. I must find Daddy. There is something inside. I'm scared. Oh, here we go. Now, <clears throat> I'm pretty sure Daddy is in his office. Oh, what the hell? I hope that thing has, has gone away. I'm still frightened. But if I stay still, it may come back. Can't run, that's for sure. Oh shit! Piece of paper. Every time I look back, everything seems as, seems back as I was not there. Doors are closed, the monsters are there again. But the things I left behind are still there. Like the house is there, is not here, frozen somewhere. Where am I, Jack? Okay. Somebody is real. Did recognize some Jack's hiding place. Jack? Oh fuck! You don't see me? Did 
Oh, that is actually... I don't know where it went. But it would be very nice to have some sort of sprint. No locks in it. Hmm. Well, it looks like I could get over here. What was that creature? I'm scared. This is just a dream, a nightmare. I'm pretty sure about it, but why can't I wake up? Huh, there's no luck. The fireplace, it's lit. I don't know why, but I feel safer in here. Daddy is not here. But I must find him. We must take mommy and leave. We didn't see the mother, or did we? There's something on the sofa, you can't reach it. So I need to find stuff in here. Oh. Move your cursor. Spitty Sparty clip them. Eat to switch between the items you clipped. Okay, I haven't gotten anything. The reflection looks back at your work at you worried. This is not a dream, is it? I can't wake up. Oh, that's a safe one. There are two pictures. Oh, wow. Three others is one of your drawings. I'm still me. Okay. So this behaves actually like a RE save room. Except unlike our Resident Evil, I can't sprint or anything like that. So... I, I guess the name of the game is to... Listen, guys. Alright, well, here we go. It's cold. I feel watched. Are there other monsters? It's it hurts. I must move. Jane. Fuck. Okay. Jeez. Okay. Those matches lets me light up the safe area. Okay, okay. This, it is locked. 
I'm just gonna paint the guns on the other side. Okay, uh... Can't do anything. So... Wait, distinct melody comes on the other side. Daddy's office right this way, but the door is locked. Okay, okay. Well, I got a key. <clears throat> the door slams behind you. <laughs> there, there is... There, there is someone. I hear you're laughing. What the hell? What the hell? Seems like someone is in here, smiling at you. You try to touch it. Soft like a dress. Oh, I... Oh jeez, these hitbox- the desk hitboxes are really, really big. Uh... Right. Okay, I guess I gotta find the... I gotta find the dolls. Okay. Uh, jeez, a sprint would be nice. I feel like I'm not even walking at this point. No! Oh, you got... Okay, I see how it plays now. Right. I gotta catch it before it completely fades away. One, two. Oh, come on. Jeez. I can already see one of the issues of this game. No. Really? Hitboxes. It is far too big for what it's supposed to do. Alright. Three? Is it making... Is it making fun of you? Huh. Oh, here we go. Uh... Right. The key to the piano room. When you touch it, it became transparent for a brief moment. Which one had the box? The vanishing key slips through the lock. A sad sonata envelops you. The door slams behind you. The instruments are playing by themselves. This song, it gets my head spinning. Oh, I... Okay, I'm playing Dodge the Music. The music is too loud. I can't proceed further. 
Jeez. What the hell? Oh, please don't kill. So I just get ported back here. At least I don't lo completely lose progress. May as well check these other areas out. Doors locked. Oh, I'm dead. Jeez. So... I just get... I just get murderized by them and ported back to where I was. If they touch me. Yeah, I guess that's the vanishing... Alright. Someone's left already. They see you from the wall. Okay. Yikes. Alright, so... I guess I can avoid the... Moose? Maybe? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Uh... This is definitely something interesting, that's for sure. And it just came out to it just came out yesterday as well. My only gripe is that I don't feel when I'm walking, I don't feel like my character is walking. More like I'm just I'm just like stumbling along. I wish they could Come on now. Wait a second. Wait a, wait a second. Oh, please don't tell me. Okay. Okay, so I think that might be a bug there. There's like no prompts when I came up to that one. Alright. I guess I gotta avoid just gotta avoid the music. Boxes is fairly generous, generous ish. 
And this is the tricky one. Oh, wow. Oh, that curveball. Hmm? I don't remember coming this way. Oh, wait, don't tell me. Really? The game just... It wasn't a death scene. The game just teleports me. Oh, that's even worse than just ha having the death screen and being ported back. It just... Oh, I don't think I like that particular mechanic. Yeah. If it just... If being caught, quote-unquote, ports me back to where I... A random part of the house? Oh, I really hope they... I really hope the developers, like, change that to at least reset back to the... Main... To the last door you entered. The last screen changing door, I should actually say. Because if it's just uh, teleporting you around the place, I could definitely see the frustration factor skyrocketing. I could see it getting a lot. I could see it getting a lot, lot worse, considering you can't even run. Alright, well. Uh, here we go, I guess. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. And you can't skip any of the text if you've seen it. Jeez. Alright. There we go. Song gets my head spinning. Music is too loud. Doesn't make sense why you can't just bypass it. Okay, here's the tricky one. Whoa! a teleport. It's a, a damn straight up teleport. Oh, I... Okay, I have some, I really have some choice words for walk speed right here. I understand the fact that she's in a dress, but at the same time, she's not wearing heels. It's her own house. Uh, well, I'm going to keep trying at least. Here we go. Alright, here we go, here we go. Uh, 
I went upwards a lot. I want to try downwards. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Screen. Screen just ups and shakes. Okay, uh... Right. Okay. Okay, uh... Well, while the game is... The game has a different art style to it, and it is a bit more methodical than your average uh, horror game. Hear that. Definitely hear that thing. Uh Okay, uh Right. I want to at least get past that, uh, that vanishing key room before I make any, uh, comments on it. But if I... What was that? If I can't get past it again, uh, I'll probably call the episode there while I make my, uh, analysis on the game. Because... Honestly, I don't want to have to rewalk the same hallways just to, get, just to get back to where I was. All right, here we go. Oh, I think I see. Uh, I'm guessing the blue just stalls them. Or at least slows down, weakens them enough so that I can actually do something. Okay, okay, okay. I understand that particular mechanic now. It isn't gonna stop them in their tracks, but at least it'll slow them down enough for me to... Do something about it. Come on now. Oh, I. Do I have to go back down in this room again just to trigger it? All right. Alright, let me in this room, that's the musical notes room, uh, okay, uh, right, come on now, hmm, I can't get in the room, I'm probably gonna have to, yep, I'm, Definitely can't get in the room now. Uh, oh, that's a bummer. I really, th I really thought I had it the last time, but I guess for now I'm gonna have to give my opinion on it. Uh, it's definitely another, a more slower and methodical, uh, top-down horror game. That's for sure. Uh. With the walk speed as it is, you have to, like, you have to think ahead. That being said, uh, one of the things that hold it back, and I think could be improved on, is the fact that, 
uh, the character's hitboxes in relation to other objects is un... I'd like to say it's big, but it's a bit too big. I mean, like, the desk in that desk uh, chasing scene uh, itself kind of highlights it best. Like, I'm not even... I'm barely close to the desk at all, and I'm being uh, bumped into the middle. Whereas, like, one side is all practically has no a hitbox on it, so there's that. Another thing, walk speed. God damn, speed up the walk speed a little bit. I can partially understand it's the character's in a dress and she's scared and doesn't want to make unnecessary movements, but... At least let her walk around a little bit faster. <sighs> and another another thing, like, if you're gonna disable sprint, at least let me have the option to look further down right, right or left, so that I can actually see what's ahead of me and properly prepare for it, because I can understand uh, being caught off guard by the fact that uh, you aren't expecting something to come right at you, but at the same time, if you don't have a sprint option, you that's just effectively just blindsiding you for a teleport. Oh, and don't get e don't even get me started on the random teleport back to the entrance. Uh, teleport, uh, teleport on death. I don't mind it if you send me back to the, uh, the previous door. A screen changing door I went through, but if you're gonna force me back all the way to the beginning, then yeah, you might wanna lock that back to the door, back to at least the uh, last screen changing door. So like from the fire, the first safe area fireplace room to. Uh, where my character is right now, that should, if I die in this particular area, I should at least uh, respawn back uh, in this same area. Not all the way back to the girl's room. Uh, <clears throat> let's see, what else, what else? There's not, while I understand that the enemy itself, it only... It, you have to like compensate the enemies just like move in a predefined area at least give them a little bit more uh, opportunities to opportunities to like uh, spot the player because maybe that could be just me nitpicking because there's only like I only have access to like this area and like the hallways and this is the only area that has like scene area so I don't know if that could change in the future since this is a pre alpha but there's that so pretty much uh the goods of this game is that it has a unique art style it's a bit more uh methodical for considering for being a horror game and uh pacing is pretty decent oh i actually uh cons and things of things of areas you could improve on uh death respawn uh lock it to the current area or at least the area where if i die in that area that has a screen change put me back in the same area after i went through the door you know what i'm talking about uh Sprint speed, speed it up a little bit, that at least help give me the option for to look left and right of my character. Since I'm lacking, there's no sprint in the game, and uh, text, that's what I was about to say, uh, text. At least give me the option to scroll through the text at my own pace. Uh, beyond that, there's not much to change. I understand this is a pre-alpha, and... Pretty much what I what I say right now is probably could be moot in like the next build, but I guess on that note, uh, I'll I'll just leave those comments to the developer and let the developer 
take them or toss them as they will. So on that note, thank you for watching this video. If you like what you saw, throw this video a like. And if you want to see more contents like this, subscribe, subscribe to my channel. Until then, I'll see you in the next video.